Slowing down. What do we got? Somebody new? I see you, Warlock. I see you, Warlock. Woo! Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. So I just got done with the July Cavalier event quest. We did an initial clear. I also went ahead and explored the final quest all on stream. I'm a little bit exhausted. It takes a little bit more concentration trying to read the chat and do those fights. But I also got the... Uh, offer at the end. And with that offer, we get, um, of course, six star shards. So we're going to open up a six star uh, crystal because we got enough to uh, open one up. And these Cavalier crystals, which are horrible value. But that's not why I get the offer. So let's go ahead and spin some of these out here. And we can get a good champion out of this. Uh, I've gotten really good luck. I've gotten bad luck. Uh, most of the time I get three stars, but I have gotten six stars out of here. That would be phenomenal, getting a six star from these uh, Cavalier Crystals. I remember when they first came into the contest, their drop rates seemed to be a lot better than they are now. Um, we never heard anything about a change in the drop rate, but it seemed pretty obvious. All right. Uh, first Crystal. What do we got? Okay. Okay. A five-star uh, Punisher. Uh, I saw that Falcon. I already have him. Uh, so he would have been a dupe. But it would have been a welcome dupe. Especially out of these. Um, but a five-star, I will take it. Uh, I may take that Kingpin up unless I get him as a uh, six-star. But I may take him up. Because he looks like he's a lot of fun as well. Um, but really, out of this, uh, these crystals, the main thing that I would want uh, is a new champion, either a new five-star champion or a new six-star champion. I'm not going to get a new three or four-star champion. They're all going to be dupes, but five and six-star, um, most of the five-stars will be dupes, but there are a number that I don't have. And six-stars, there's a ton that I don't have. So any new champion would be phenomenal. All right, slowing down. All we see is three stars right now. Yep, three star and an Iron Patriot at that. All right. Uh, also, all of my three stars are max sig. So it'll be max signature ability crystals. Uh, they come in useful sometimes if I am trying to, you know, get like that last bit um, to maybe have an even opening. Like, you know, I'm, I'm at three crystals uh, worth of shards and I want to get to four, you know, uh, then I might open up a bunch of four stars so that I can get more, uh, five star shards. And that's what I would end up, uh, doing. I would, uh, open up a lot of the max signature ability crystals that you get from duping a three star, which will give me more four star shards so I can open more four stars and get five star shards. All right. What do we got here? And another three star. But hey, we got a five star out of this, so uh, that's already a win win. All right. Maybe we'll get all the bad juju out of the way so that uh, when we open up our six star, we'll get somebody good. Um, and there's plenty, plenty of six stars that I would like. Um, anybody new, of course, but um, new champions are coming in very slowly these days. So they are very special when they happen, even if it's a new champion that I'm probably not going to use outside of the arena. I'll still take it. All right. Come on. I'm just looking here, and I'm seeing some really nice six stars I wouldn't mind. All right. What do we got? And it's another three star. Now, that Ant-Man would have been welcome, but he also would have been a dupe. So we haven't even gotten close to getting a new champion. 
uh, of any variety, five or six star. Um, I see a six star Professor X would love that. Um, I see Corvus, but I already have Corvus at rank three and he's uh, duped. Don't really need any more dupes on him. I see Sorcerer Supreme would definitely love to get her uh, out of this. So really, anybody new, I see uh, Magneto. He's already duped, but more dupes on Magneto is good. Uh, more uh, damage resistance, I guess you would say, or reduction. Um, but I do have the five star maxed out. All right, last one. What do we got? Okay, and we ended it with a five star, another dupe, but what's he up to now? Okay, I only duped him once before. Not too terrible, not too terrible. Of course, we're not gonna be using him anytime soon. Maybe he'll get a buff with the new Loki series out, but chances are Kabam will create a whole new version of Loki and add it to the game, um, but we'll see. All right, now let's get to the big featured, not a featured six star. I don't open those. Uh, we're gonna open up just a little old basic. We'll do a little pep method. Go out, go back in. Go out, and before we spin it, let me pop this up here. Boom, boom. All right, so those are the champions that I want the most whether it be new or dupe. So Silver Surfer, Doom, Warlock, um, Cosmic Ghost Rider, and Apocalypse. Now, those are my most wanted, but they're not the only champions that I will be very happy to get. You know, you don't see Professor X up there. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure if he's in this crystal yet, um, but there's a lot of other champions that I don't have that I would love. And at the bottom, in order of desirability, dupe, I want Nick Fury duped the most. He, I think, needs it the most. Ghost is already ranked three. Would love to awaken my ghost. That would be phenomenal, okay? Um, Captain America Infinity War duped. He has the highest, if I remember correctly, duped prestige, just at SIG 20. Um, uh, definitely of the uh, science, but but his it's pretty high at 20, but then it levels off. So if you dupe him, take him up, it'll be a nice uh, prestige bump. All right. Uh, we got Thing, who has great prestige, and Sorcerer Supreme, who also has great prestige. All right. So let's go ahead and put it on the spinner. Boom. So if we can't get anyone on that list, I would love to just get a new champion. Don't even care who it is. Um, but I would say of the champions that I have that are the most wanted, I really want a Warlock more than anybody else. Now, Doom um, and Silver Surfer are great for prestige, so I would definitely love them. Doom is a beast, um, but I run Suicide, so um, I wouldn't be able to make as much use of him. Um, but any new champion... Um, I saw cables swinging around. I just took my cable up. I won't be upset if I got another cable uh, as a six star. All right, slowing down. What do we got? Somebody new? I see you, Warlock. I see you, Warlock. Woo! Yes! Oh! Oh, yes! Prestige! Okay. Not only is that a new champion, but currently this is the highest prestige in the game. He has the highest prestige in the game, guys. Now, I need to awaken him. But let me show you guys something here. Let's take a look at my inventory. Ooh, ooh, yes. Oh, boy. Okay. All right. Um, What was I doing? So, I don't have a way to awaken him just yet. But I will. Uh, let me see. Do I have? All right. So I have 46 of the, um, cosmic. I also have 18 plus one generics and five plus five. So 20, uh, of these generic six star six stones. So 
we can get him, what, 20, 60, uh, almost 80. You know, just doing quick napkin math. Uh, almost 80 SIG. But as far as ranking him up, look at that. That's what I was holding it for. That's why I said when I got a second one, not a problem. I'll have somebody that I can use it on. So he will get that gem. Of course, I do have uh, some generics, but not going to do that. He will get it. And all I need to do now is awaken him. Whew, that's a big boy uh, pull right there. And to put icing on the cake, it evens out my arena teams. So I now have even arena teams. Oh, wow. That was insane, guys. As far as prestige goes, that was better than pulling Doom, but Doom has more utility and, and use, of course. Um, but wow. Now, now, the only thing about pulling him now is I don't have a way to awaken him. If I had pulled Doom, I actually have a... Um, a mystic awakening gem. So I could awaken Doom if I had pulled him. Um, but, and I just used my generic. And by the way, no regrets. I used my generic on Namor and took him up to SIG 200. That was great prestige. And he is a good champion that I have been using in questing. If I had pulled this Silver Surfer before I did that, I still would have done that with Namor. I still would have used the generic on Namor and took him up rather than using the generic on Silver Surfer and taking him up. Why? Because Namor, I would use more. Um, but this is crazy. This, this is the jackpot right here. This is what's up. I will use every single, once I can get him awakened, I'll be saving now, but every single Sig Stone that I can goes into him all right so that's gonna do it guys thank you all for watching man i am exhausted now i gotta take a break take care hit the like button if you enjoyed this video as much as i enjoyed making it leave a comment let me know what you thought about this video and you all have a blessed day